everybody how y'all doing how's your mama doing i know i just did a video once before but i thought this was way funny as shit amanda bonds rides with bonds jail fines motherfucker no but uh you may know her from the show uh all that or that movie where she did with frankie muniz this big liar or she's the man in hairspray or easy a the bitch that actually decided to retire at the age of 25 got in trouble months ago about a DUI. I said this is why see see what happens when you give see what happens when parents don't pay attention to their children when they get in the spotlight they turn out to be fucked up once they get over the age of 21 or 18 see this is why I hate Justin Bieber so much or Miley Cyrus because they end up being, doing the dumbest shit on the block because their fucking parents only cares about that dollar dollar bills y'all but this dummy, I'm actually on her Twitter page. And I thought it was funny because she tweeted to Obama, President Barack Obama, about fixing her shit. I'm going to show you what the fuck she said. This is her page. Okay, hold on. Okay, this is her Twitter page. Never fix this, okay. Okay, I'm fucking like, okay. I fucked up, but this is her Twitter page, Amanda Bynes. Amanda Bynes. This is Hey Barack Obama. I didn't. I don't drink. Please fire the cop who arrested me. I saw I didn't hit and run the end. Like this is dumb for this is her shit. And this is what she put. Now. I know ain't the smartest tool in the shed, but why would you treat to Barack Obama to fix your DUI ticket? Bitch, you as dumb as fuck. You can't tweet to the president suspecting that he's gonna fix your DUI. Are you there? Are you much? Uh, she's a fucking Riri. I'm for real though. She is a Riri. How are you gonna tweet to Barack Obama to fix your DUI that you fucked up that you did? You can't tweet the, per the president. Oh, uh, oh, President Obama, can you get me out of a ticket? Oh, uh, President Obama, can you get me? Can you pay my taxes for President Obama? President Obama is not gonna drop everything he does just to tend to your bitch ass. You as dumb as a box of rocks, bag of hammers. You stupid as can be, bitch. You ain't shit. You see, you you dumb enough to retire at age of 25. There's fuckers that are in their 60s, 70s, 80s, and 90s still acting, and your bitch ass retires at 25. Are you kidding me? Are you serious? That you're gonna sit there and ask Barack Obama to pay out uh, to get you out of a jam and fire the popo that look they should look some oh if they can arrest people for stupid tweets I wish they arrested her ass because she be on top of America's most wanted list cause there's and bitch why did you dye your hair pink that shit does not make you look good are you trying to be like pink bitch you ain't no rocker you just a Kid. See, this is why kid. See, back in the day, back in the day, kid actors got fucked up so badly. Look at Tom Bridges, Danny Bonaduce, Jamie Foxx were from that from the '60s, '70s, '80s, and '90s. Kid, teen kids, kid actors or teen actors got fucked up because their lives were so fucked up. They did not know how to do anything else outside of the business. And she was in the business until 2000, such and such, so on, whatever. And she don't know the value of anything. She thinks just because she got a big, her name ain't even that fucking big, I don't see it. Her name's not even big. Sylvester Stallone, that's a big name. Eddie Murphy, that's a big name. Cat Williams, that's a big name. Ice Cube, that's a big name. Oh, they got some big names. Michael Douglas, Kurt Douglas, uh, 
who else? Uh, <laughs> uh, Jackie Chan, Chris Tucker, big name people. Your ass ain't shit. Even Shia LaBeouf's ass got a bigger name than you, and he was on Disney doing the Even Stevens show. And this is funny, and your bitch ass tweeted, "Oh, mama, can you give me any thumbo? Is he your mom? Is he your daddy? If he your daddy, man, you you would have had a fatter ass or, some, or bigger lips. You would have been loving on some turner greens and, ne and some neck bones and some chitterlings. I mean, chitterlings." But you was just one dumb bitch. <laughs> you dumber than a box of rocks, bag of hammers, man, girl. You don't know what the fuck you're doing. Like I said, I, I hope people can go to her Twitter. Respond to, look, I'm going to show her Twitter shit again. This is her Twitter page, Amanda Bynes. Go to her page <laughs> and respond to this dumb piece of shit she posted. Hey, Barack Obama. I don't drink. Please find the cop who arrested me. I just don't, just don't hit and run. Don't eat. I'm for real. I ain't never met a fucking re re. I ain't. Thank God I'm not in Hollywood. Cause if I was friends with this bitch, I would have. I would have cut my losses. And said, you know what? I don't even know you, bitch. I would have went on the witness stand line. Yeah, man. Last week she ran over a dog. She had a cat. She was. She was drunk off a ad. I could have smelled the kibasi on her breath. I'm for real though, man. She went from a cute little girl to a fine young woman to a dumbass bitch quick. I say, see, and it's and, and I feel bad. And she was on the same show with Kenan Thompson. Now you look at Kenan Thompson, child actor. He went from all that to Kenan and Kill to being the Rocky Bullwinkle movie to doing Good Burger and ended up on SNL. He went on SNL Saturday Night Live and making good money and your dumb ass bitch hits a cop car, gets arrested for toxic, uh, being drunk in public and go tweet to President Obama saying get me out of trouble and then you retire at the age of 25. Hold on, hold on. Am I missing anything out of this? Like, I want you to do like, you know what, you know what, you know what be something else, man? It's going to probably even be fucked up if Miley Cyrus and Amanda Bynes do a fucking porno movie. I bet this shit would sell like a motherfucker. But damn it, man. I'm telling you, that is the most dumbest bitch that ever hit the media, that ever got into a movie, that ever been on a TV show, that ever hit the mainstream. Like, are you fucking serious, man? A damn retarded child is smarter than Amanda Bynes. I would say Pistol Palin, but she's dumb as a box rock, just like her mama. She makes George Bush look like the smartest man on earth. Now that's some shit. How do you make the dumbest man on earth look like the smartest motherfucker that ever lived? Damn. Even the inmates were like, man, I can't jack off to that bitch no more. That was just dumb shit. I can't. I bet you see all the rapists in prison sitting up and say, man, I wouldn't even rape her if she was the last piece of ass on her. That's what I'm saying. All the rapists be like, man, fuck that bitch. I, I just turned myself in. I don't care if that bitch was all over the street today. All the damn rapists was like, man, you know what, Popo, -po, just lock me up, dude. That is, she ain't even worth it. She ain't back. She back in the day. I would've hit that, but now I just take my ass in. Bitch, you made you made dudes want to turn themselves in. You made if Perez Hilton was straight, he'll go gay just because your dumb ass. Damn, if Frankie Muniz ran to your ass, she's like he was just. If Frankie Muniz was on walking down the sidewalk and see a man in he was hide his face like I don't know that, or just try not to look. I don't know that bitch. I don't know that bitch. Girlfriend or wife, whatever. Like, then you used to work. Oh no, 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 no. That was a different girl. That was a different girl. That's how fucked up that shit is, man. I wouldn't even fuck with her. Damn. Well, I'm just, I'm for real though. That her career is just. That's what happens, man. I'm supposed to. 
uh, Anderson Cooper's video about what he said about it. It was like this. Amanda Bynes, you fucking up your shit. You was like Miley Cyrus. You on the same road with Miley when you on the same path when Miley Cyrus was fucking up. You on the same path when Lizzie Lohan was fucking up. You're on the same path as the rest of all, all these people. And <laughs> you suspect people should be ki kissing your ass. Like, girl, are, are you for real? This, I don't get you. That you set up there and you <laughs> going to tweet to President Obama. Bring your mama, bring me a deal. Bring me a deal. Riri, Riri, that's a, that's the dumbest bitch ever. I'm for real though. I am. For, oh man, there was no words for shit like that. There is no words. I I'm for real though, dude. Like. I'd rather buy her porn movie if she did one than watch her act again. I'm for real though. I'd rather watch a porn movie, watch her doing porn with Miley Cyrus than ever watch a fucking movie she did. Because it makes no sense. It makes no sense that this girl will fuck herself out of so much just because of what? Because she's got money and she thinks she's got a big name. Look, if you want to have a big name in that business, you got to stay off that shit. Look at Jack Nicholson, the biggest name out there, man. Great motherfucking actor. You don't hear him. Like, he had his little moments, but you don't hear him going out doing the shit he does doing the shit what y'all doing now that like all these old ass actors say well at least they ain't gonna act stupid in the limelight hell no you don't hell no you don't cause you already got dumbasses like Amanda Bynes sitting up there doing it for you hey man I watched Amanda Bynes thought about going out getting liquored up but it looks like she did it for me she looks how I feel like that is just that is just something else, man. I cannot just, oh, Lord Jesus. Can somebody pray Somebody pray for this girl? I'm just waiting for you, you to, now, hold on, you porn or X hamster or Bang Bros or somebody else to come up to her and say, you want to do a porn? I bet she'd jump to it. Yeah, since I ain't got nothing else to do. My career is going down the drain. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. For real, dude. Like, oh my God. How do you... Why would you tweet shit like that to President Obama? Wow, that's the that's the, that's the biggest question. Why would you tweet that? If he's running the country, do, do you think he has time to try to get you out of a DUI or probation? Why don't you do like Lindsay Lohan did? Steal something. Get on crack. Do something like uh, with a... Uh, Kim Kardashian did do a porn tape. Why don't you do something like a Amy Winehouse? Get hyped up on drugs, drink yourself to death because your shit is going down here, girl. You cannot bounce back on half the shit, man. I don't think Missy Lohan can bounce bounce back. I'm telling you, man, this is some bullshit, man. I ain't never in my life ever thought, man, that this I would see the day, man. See, and y'all wonder why I talk so much shit about kid, uh, kid actors, kids that's in the spotlight because they don't know what to do when they get that taste of that fame. For real, they really don't. See, this is what happens when you let kids get a taste of that fucking fame. And then all that shit goes to their head and only things their parents will see is that money. They don't give a fuck what the kid does after, the, after they start getting gigs. Them kids can be 13 years old sitting up there snorting and je snorting cocaine, injecting heroin into their eyeballs or whatever. They don't give a fuck. That kid can kill. That kid can kill five people 
as long as they get the as long as the parents get paid good money. And see what happens when you elect, when you when kids don't get watched, when they in the spotlight, they grow up to be pain in the ass and fucking their lives up when they get adults. See what happened? Now you look at my, you now you look at Master P son, little Romeo. Master P cracked that fucking whip on his son's ass. Tell you getting that college education, boy. I don't give a fuck. They can. I said that damn studio and that TV show can wait. Now that boy's got a good education. Look at him now. Just in case the entertainment business doesn't work out, he has something to fall back on. Now you look at these kids. Now you look at Amanda Bynes and. Miley Cyrus and uh, uh, Chris, I will say Chris Brown, but he ain't shit. Justin Bieber, he gonna be the same damn way. Same damn way, he gonna be doing that shit too. Y'all motherfuckers kissing his bitch ass, man. Food in the pants and shit. Watch that boy fuck up and kill a good couple of people and y'all still trying to bail his bitch ass out of jail. That's what's wrong with y'all today. Y'all so y'all all these damn parents and these damn adults are so obsessed with these damn or whatever obsessed with these damn kids. So obsessed with these damn kids, these teen actors don't know what to do. They let the kids watch these little bastards and get away with it. These kids are watching these kids like her. That means these kids are watching them. And they growing up doing the same damn thing, acting the same damn way, dressing the same damn way, and getting and y'all motherfucking parents ain't cracking that fucking belt across their ass. Oh, you can't beat them. Fuck that, man. Whip that ass, man. So your kids don't end up like Amanda Bynes or Lindsay Lohan. What is wrong with y'all today, man? The damn kids get in the spotlight and end up being spoiled little bitches. And all these damn parents can do. Oh, I love my kids. But that money comes first. He's paying my house off. See, the parents can. That's, that's something else, man. The, the damn kids. Them teen, the damn kid actors today. One like the ones back in the day. See, the teen, kid actors today. They can go to rehab. They can, get, they can go to rehab for a week. Oh, I'm clean, I'm clean, I'm clean. Get out the next day, clean as a fucking whistle. But you look at the ones that was do the fifth, like from the fifties, sixties, no, from the sixties, seventies, eighties, and nineties. They didn't go through the this process. They went through hell and back. Now you look at her. Now you look at her. Oh yeah, these fuckers are getting away with so much shit. I just don't get these fuckers today, man. They ass kissing like a motherfucker. Like, for real. I'm at, like I said, I'm put the Anderson Cooper video in the description box. And I, and, and I want y'all to tell me what you think. Follow me on Twitter, Afro Joe the Wookie. Subscribe to my channel, CeeLo Jr. 2 to CeeLo Jr. 3. Like I said, if y'all go up on Twitter... And y'all, <laughs> now look a minute about up on Twitter and just start telling like it is to it. Don't sit there and be dirt, very dirty. I hope you're going to hang yourself. No, 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 don't do this shit. Go in there and just tell like it is to it, man. Bitch, you dumb as shit. Like, just say, look, man, Obama ain't got time for your little bullshit games. Grow up. Take responsibility. Because that's what she needs to do is take responsibility for her actions. She don't need to be sitting up there calling out the president calling out the president asking for help because it's not his job to save your ass from jail time it's not he got enough shit on his plate and I don't think your dumb ass needs to be on his plate too trying to say oh President Obama can you get a new one I you me you me you you me you mama 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 no he ain't got time for that shit Amanda Bonds you gotta grow the fuck up now like I said, man, follow me on Twitter, Afro Joe the Wookie. Subscribe to my channel, CeeLo Dream 2 and CeeLo Dream 3. And tell me what you think about this shit, man. Her being such a dumbass. Peace, love, and Afro Grease, y'all. Peace. Peace. Peace.